the molar mass of a substance is the mass in grams per mole of that substance. And this gives the mass for an entire mole of those atoms, or 6.02 times 10 to the 23 of those atoms. We can use the molar mass to perform conversion problems like this one. In this case, we will convert from grams to moles. All we need is the molar mass. To find the molar mass of this compound, we'll first find the molar mass of iron and oxygen on the periodic table. We'll add these molar masses up according to the chemical formula. There's two irons and three oxygens. I add these up and the molar mass can be written as 159.6 grams over one mole, or one mole over 159.6 grams. Either way, it means the same thing. It's a ratio that shows the mass for one mole of this compound. I'm going to use dimensional analysis to solve this problem. I start with the given value, then I multiply by a conversion factor that will cancel the starting unit and give me the new unit. I want to cancel grams, so I put that on the bottom. Then I put moles on the top. Now I put my numbers in according to the molar mass I just figured out. One over something like this just means to divide by. So 92.2 divided by 159.6 gives 0.578 moles.